subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! Right, guys. <laughs> right, guys, here we are in Bonnie, Scotland. A couple of days before Christmas. Our good friend Sinkler Patience has kindly joined us and today we're going to do some Highland Games events. But before that, we want to inform you where we're standing in this majestic <laughs> field. This is where the Stoltman Games is going to be. As you can see, work is, uh, is currently under construction at the moment, so that'll be the Stoltman Games HQ that we're, we're getting we're built. That's where you get <laughs> drunk, get you changed, have some fun. The Pulse celebrations. Today we're going to try a few different Highland Games events. Most of them are for distance. Have you done any throwing before? Um, a little bit. Nothing to throw in the wife. <laughs> That's about it. Why do you throw the wife? When she annoys me, you know. Woo! <laughs> a little bit of shot put in school. Yeah, a little bit of shot yeah, put in school, but plastic nothing. Plastic balls, not these ones. Was it? Was it? That's a long yeah, time. Yeah, plastic ago. balls. Yeah, we weren't. Like just yeah, you did it. That well. was just you. <laughs> you weren't allowed heavy objects. Okay, so. I wasn't allowed heavy objects. I had to use a foam javelin as well. In Highland Games, there's about five different events we do, right. but there's light and heavy implements. Um, so today we'll mainly try the light. Got you. But then at the end, we're going to go with a 56 pound, 25 kilo weight over the bar. Um, and it's a strong man that's got the world record, so half the I thought I'm coming for you. He's, he's got the world record, 20 foot, 20 foot, two inches, I think. We're gonna we're gonna start in the middle. A little bit of shot putt. So right. You've probably seen uh, seen the shot putt on TV. Yeah, yeah. Athletics is 7.25 kilos. Right. Um, I think Eddie Hall had a wee video not too long ago and hit about 14 meters. That's the goal today. Eh? Eddie, you're going down. <laughs> We're um, the beast in Scotland. So that's what we'll do first, is a wee bit of shot putt, right. and then we'll uh, go on for some weight for distance, which is 28 pounds, so I think that's 12 and a half kilos. Right. But we're going to try and use a little bit of a, a rotational technique. Right. So we'll get you spinning so to a bit of dancing. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll go, we'll go for that. Cool. Then uh, the Scots hammer. Oof. So again, there's the Olympic hammer, which is a ball on a wire. Right, yeah. yeah. With the Scots hammer, it's a rattan shaft, so it's quite a flexible wood. Um, you spin it around your head for distance again. Right. The only one that's not for distance today is the, the weight for height. Uh, we don't have stands, but I think we'll get a good idea of, of how high you're yep. throwing it. So nice those are the four events we're going to try, and cool. Tom's going to hit a world record at the end. Easy. And, and you did, you, you do Highland Games as well, don't yep. you? So, I do the, the professional circuit in the Highland Games, which is, uh, I'll usually do about 20 to 25 games a year. Right. Most in Scotland, but every year there's probably about four or five where I'll travel travel overseas. So right. I've done about probably six or seven world championships. Right. Um, some guys are, are full-time uh, Highland Games now, so uh -huh. it's growing all the time. And what's your best finish in the world? So what did you... Best finish in Worlds is sixth. In the sixth, uh, right? sixth and then... Seventh and an eighth. We're in good hands today, then. Well, I wouldn't say that, but <laughs> we'll give it a go. Uh, you excited, Tom? I need to sign up a post proclaimer thing. Eh? <laughs> See if I get injured, then uh, it's my career over. <laughs> we're doing the Highland Games. We are Highlanders. I don't think we're quite dressed appropriately, so I think we better go and put some kilts on. Yeah, buddy. Let's do this. Ready? Let's, Let's do, do this. this. Woo! Shake there. That's for me. First event we're gonna have a look at is the shot putt. So I'll do a quick demonstration and then we'll let the boys have a shot. So with the shot putt, the most important thing is you keep it in at your neck, right? So you're gonna hold it in at your neck with a nice high elbow, right? And it's like everything lifting wise, you're kind of looking for a triple extension, okay? So you're gonna start with your feet slightly staggered. We'll just do a standing throw first. Heel in line with toe roughly, but it's really just important that you're not closed at the front, okay? So you're gonna tuck it into your neck, Make sure your left foot's slightly back from your right, okay? And then what you want to do is get your hips in first. So, knee, hips, and then you're almost pulling your upper body round before you put it. So your arm's the very last thing to come in. Okay, so I'll just give you a quick demonstration. Okay, so we're all the way on our back leg, and then we're going knee, hips, and the arm's last thing. Okay. You world record. <laughs> Far from it. But uh, most important thing, in at your neck, high elbow. Who do you think you're going to win? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> there we are. Remember, this is a competition. 
Tuck it right in under your chin. Jeez, oh. That's it. Mobility. Elbow high. <sighs> Mind get your hips in first. Oh, jeez, oh. <laughs> oh, there we go. Nice. 10 meters. <sighs> yeah, I remember when I was that week, right? I, this is coming back to my it's school days. Up, Ready? <laughs> I can't get even see it. Get it in your hand. Get it in your hand. Come. I can't. Under um, um, your chin, sir. Yeah. My elbow. Wait on your Jesus. Wait on your back. Mate, stuff that. <laughs> That's why I'm good at lifting, not technique. That was uh, one, two, three, four, about five meters. Best out of three, three shots each. So that that wasn't bad for both of you. Uh, I think I think on on the actual release, you both kind of dropped your elbow a wee bit. That's definitely what happened to you, Tom. When you drop your elbow, you, your hand's not really going to take the force. So keep your elbow high. Send first. Who's right on a notepad? Just keep your elbow high. Elbow high. That's all you need. There you go. Look at that wolf beast. Like I said, it's hips first. So you're. You're getting everything into it and your arm's just the last thing that comes in, okay? Sorry, we have another go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh, no. Whoa, beast! Not bad, not bad. Not the tra up a traject bit. That's over 10 meters. Whoa, we're getting there, double figures. Get up, Eddie Hall. Get your right foot back a little bit. There you go. There, there you go, there. There you go. Oh, oh, there's that. Oh, Use your legs. Come on, Tommy! Come on, Tommy! Yeah. <laughs> Highland Games is not for me. I told you I've never been good. I think the best I've ever done in Highland Games is six metres in school. So if I can beat I don't six, think that's far from six metres, mate. It's about eight metres. <laughs> so I'm best now. You're improving every year. I know. Right, guys, it's the third and final one. I'm last, as always. But uh, Sink's got one more attempt to go. I Let's will go. first. So, guys, what we're going to do on this last throw is add a little bit of momentum. Oof. Okay, so you can do that however you like. Probably the, the easiest way is just a little side shuffle. Okay, so I'll go up first. Wreck your attempt, come on! Well, spin a rate. I thought it was Bali we were doing. <laughs> yeah. So, Luke, if you go up first, right try the spin or just go for the shuffle up to you. What do you think? Should you try the spin, Simon? You should try the spin, mate. <laughs> right then, here we go, spinny. Oh, get dizzy. Jeez. Oh, 20 meters. Oof. You ready for this, Brad? Are you going to beat it, Tom? <laughs> oh, I'm getting serious now. I might do it right handed. How do I spin on this? What way do I spin? It's not my career, so I don't care about embarrassing myself. <laughs> Numero uno. So I think we're about 11 metres just now. So Sink I reckon we might have a little couple of extra metres to, to try and challenge the beast. Eddie Hall's 14 metres, which would be pretty cool. So let's see what happens. And he's going to give it a shot as well, Tom. This is good at some sort of sport. Big leg. <laughs> Eddie Hall, you just got owned. 14.8 meters to this mark. You're up, son. So who won that, Sink or who? Hey, you, you two the win there, Luke, over 14 meters. 14.80, was it? Oh, yes. Good <laughs> up, yeah. What, did you, what about you, Tom? How did you enjoy that? It's all right, uh. It's all right. Just letting him win the first one. Lure me into a full sense of I, security. I need to give him some limelight for once in his life. So here, you have it. I'll oh. step out the camera. Right? Oh, thanks, guys. That's... See, big Tommy, yeah. Thanks, he's made it. We're doing something that I'm one of the best in the world. I googled it. What are we doing next? We're gonna go wait for distance next. So I don't know if you've tried that one, Tom, but <laughs> let's give it a go. The one we're using today is 28 pound, which I think is about 12 and a half kilos. Um, this one again, we do need to do a bit of rotation here. Oof. So you'll, you'll love that, Tom. Uh, <laughs> we'll give it a go. I'll, I'll demonstrate first. I'm just going to do one turn to start off, uh, and then I think by our third throw, we'll maybe try two turns. Okay? Oh, spicy! So, I'm going to get well dizzy. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> so I'm going to start a bit further back this time. You want to go, for, go for two turns. 
Okay, so what we're looking to do again is, is use our legs as much as we can. Okay, so you don't want to be upright on your legs and just use your upper body. You need to use the weight in this one. Okay, so before you throw it, try and get it swinging a little bit just to feel it. Okay, and what you want to do is throw it out on front of yourself and then your body rotates around it. Okay, so maybe try it without the weight first. You swing it back out on front of you and then your body rotates around it. Okay. Yeah, there you go, look at it. I'll just do a thing and throw it, man. Is this the same weight? Is it? Yeah, same weight. I, I, I can't do this coordination. That's it, that's it. Ah. What? Highlander. Beast. He is a Highlander, isn't he? A little swing behind yourself and then throw it out on front, okay? Once it's out on front, then get your feet around it. Okay, you keep, keep, it, this is keep it simple. Really nice. <laughs> Stop that! It's a dangerous short look. I want to go home. <laughs> you kind of took a took a header at the end. I think the weight slipped out of your hand. So this time, try a hook grip. Okay, so you'll, you'll know a hook grip from lifting. Give it a go. So. I'll just quickly show you a two turn and I will maybe take two two throws each, eh? <laughs> but hook hook it and then just relax your arm. You try to muscle it. I think with the Highland Games you want to stay long and relaxed and you're long, so just stay relaxed. Eh? So much technique. It's like that's why I don't do sports for technique. You know, it's like deadlift A to B, squat A to B. There'll be a bead in this sport, I'll figure it out, right? You could just do this. <laughs> yeah! Oh, maybe not. That was, oh, jeez, got dizzy. That was four turns. That was weird, that. Like, I don't like that. That's it. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That's near 20 metres. That's near 20 metres. Oh, lucky there, like. I like the two that guided through this ground. Second attempt, he's on it. You're winning, you're winning. Oh, it's all down to the last, last one. Throw. Last throw, boys. So are you winning it just now, Tom? Yeah. Surprisingly, yeah. Tom's mark there. 15 metres. Whoa. Ah. Right, I've got this. I'll, take, I'll do one for the fans, right? Oh, oh, nailed it. He's up. That's about 18 metres. Oofed. Not bad, Tom. That's one win each. Yes! Luke won the shot, Pat. Uh. Tom won the way for distance. Next up, we're going to try the Scots Hammer. Oofed. Uh, it's all about range, the Scots Hammer. So technically, you should you should both be pretty good. Both pretty rangy. Um, we're going to use a little bit of tacky. It's not quite like strongman tacky. It's a bit, oh. bit thinner. Nice. Okay. Uh, just because you're going to be swinging it that fast. But you don't want to be losing it out of your hands, okay? Right. So maybe just take a... Take a little bit of tacky. We're not going too much, just just a wee bit, um, and then I'll demonstrate what we're going to do with the Scots hammer. Okay, you, want, you just want to keep your arms really relaxed, Simon. If you could maybe come round a wee bit this time, uh, just because if 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 you lose the hammer, it's usually going to go out at the lowest point. Okay, so you want to swing it high above your head, and then get your hips into it a little bit. So you'll like this one, nice and spicy. Look, like. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So, I'll just show you a few swings there. Right, so high above my head, caps off. High above my head, and then I'm hitting a low point. Okay, so nice and easy. Yeah, you want it high above your head, hits a low point, and then all you're doing is turning round with it and releasing it. So it's the opposite okay, of so this one. You don't, want, you don't want to pull in and muscle it, okay? You want to stay nice, long, and like golf relax. Just like a golf swing, yeah. You should be good. Are you excited for this, mate? Yeah, I, I was eight, I was a eight handicap in golf, so. So just try a few swings first. That's it. Get it higher above your head. Yeah, yeah. You're turning, You're turning around. <laughs> You're slowly turning. So see, usually with the with the Scots hammer, I'll show you. We wear uh, 
blades on our toes. Here's the hammer boots that we normally wear. Oh, so you see the hemp bad boys. Big spikes on the end. And that's just because when you're swinging it fast enough, you will lift off the ground if you've not got them on. Uh -huh. um, so normally you would dig your toes in, and then when, when you're lifting it high above your head, it's not going to lift you off the ground. Jeez. So this hammer's 16 pounds, same weight as a shot putt, right. but we also threw a 22 pound one. So. Uh, right. But we'll not, uh, we'll not put the spikes on today. <laughs> <Come> on. <laughs> Yours. Are you surprised that Tom's pretty good at Highland Games? <laughs> Not really, no, he's, he's seven foot tall, he should be good. Chop the That's it. Matt, not bad at all, but see how the. Sometimes it's quite deceiving with Highland Games because you throw within a sector but if a throw's out left or right it'll sometimes measure further than a straight throw oh, yeah, you know yeah, yeah. So until you get the tape out you don't really know Yeah, I, I probably pulled a little bit <laughs> wow. <laughs> You're right, Tom. Did I see that? Like, she's only good at shot, Pat. Tommy, Tommy. Oh. Tommy. Ooh, Tommy Three events down. Tom's taking two. Luke's got one. Yes. I think that suits you, Tom. You've got the, you've got the range, you've got the long arms. Um, just nice and relaxed, I love being relaxed and chilled all the time. You've hit over 30 metres, uh, which for a first attempt is pretty, pretty impressive. I think if we got you a few sessions in, some spikes on your feet, you'd be up another 10 metres anyway. Oh. So we're going to wrap up with a wee bit of weight over the bar. Yeah. Um, so again, this is the one that a strong man holds the world record in. Uh, in the Scottish Games, the record's just over 17 foot, but in the, in the sort of world Highland Games, it's 20 foot for a strong man. Okay, so we'll see. Uh, Tom, you won the keg toss at Worlds. Yes. So you should be technically pretty good at this one, okay? We'll see what happens. Eh? Fourth and final event we're going to try today oh. is the 56 pound weight for height. Um, so this is the only one we've tried where we're not going for distance and instead we're, we're going as high as we can. World record's 20 foot. Tom's going to try and break out of the Stokeman Games. Yes, sir. Uh, 50k, baby. First warm up, first warm up today. <laughs> so you're going to show us how to. Right, what, what we're going to try and do, I know like a lot of a lot of strong men when they try the 56, they drop it to their heels and then rip it because they're really strong and they're still able to get a good height on it. Right. But what you kind of want to try and do is take the weight in high and then drop drop low with it. And then it's that triple extension. Right. Well, this is my worst event. Right. I'll give a quick demo, so show you how it's oh. done, uh, and then you can have a go. So again, you might want to use the hook grip, just so you keep your your hand relaxed, your arm relaxed. Okay. We side swing if you want, and then you're going to take it in high, drop low with it. Oh. Okay. So, oh. who wants to go up first? You're first. We reckon the break on the goalpost there. Yeah. Um, is about 15 foot. That's that's a good a good height for most Highland Games. Um, some of the top boys will go up to sort of 17 foot. So if you're hitting the break, you're you're doing pretty well. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, put your put your left hand on your thigh next time. Oh. You get a bit of push off it. Tommy! Oh. Nice, that's about 
Oh, I like my, my technique. I can't do that drop. So in foot broth. How did you find the new technique? I don't even know if I used it. <laughs> Tom's technique. Oh. Come on, Tom! You can get out the ground this time. I think that was the highest one yet, Tom. Uh, I reckon you'd be 17 and a half, 18 oh, feet there. So. New Scottish record. Again, the, the Highland Games record, if you've done all events, is about 17, <whistles> 2 or 4. But uh, you're going for 20, so a couple of foot to go. Four Highland Games events done. Um, Tom, we reckon on the last one there, you're probably hitting about 17 and a half foot. Uh, you're 3-1 you're up on Luke, but I think you've maybe got a wee challenge for him to, to wrap yes. us up today. Eh? So we're going to do the Stopman Javelin. Oh, <laughs> what weight's in this, Tom? 25 kilos. 25 kilos yeah. in the Javelin. This you is can throw it any way you want. This is one they use in the Olympics. But it has to stick in the ground to count. You know, for distance then? Yeah, distance, yeah. Good stuff, double it has points. To stick in the ground. Double it, points. It can't go like this. It has to go. We're going to do rock, paper, scissors. Whoever whoever loses that is going first. Right, is it three then go? Yeah. So one, one, two, two three, three, go. Right. Okay. One, two, three. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> just two go to see yeah. who goes. Oh. First, see who goes one, one, two, three, three go. Ah, sink you got me. So I'm last. Oh. Look. Sink. Tommy, Tommy. I'll put the calls in the way. I'll put the calls in the way. Ready for this? Oh, run up. Come on, Tommy. This is for all you guys that likes big poles. Look at that. Oh, over. Oh. Stuck in. So stuck in. Takes this. Sinks took it. Who's second? Because he's went the other way. Yeah, I got it. You can see. Oh, I think I got further distance. So that's. A, that's a Right, best of three, so. Best of three. Right, Tommy. Oh. 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 This is going to go miles. Oh. <laughs> is it going to stick? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> right, it's the last one for all of us. We're all going to do. The spinny technique that Sink did on the second one. Well, trust you, trust you. <laughs> Bandit. Ah, Frank! Oh, it's in! Double points for the win! Oh, <laughs> It's getting windy. It's in! It's in! Oh, that's bad. Right guys, that is the prep for the Stokeman Games done. As you can see, I was alright at that myself. Luke started off well and then deteriorated, but I think was just... You know, man's not hot and all that, but yeah. Anyway, big thanks to Sink for uh, taking us through a wee Highland Games circuit. It was cool. Um, and yeah, Good thank job. you very much. And again, this is the field where we're going to put on a splendid show come August. <laughs> stay safe, smile, stay spicy. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> Please keep ringing that little bell. Ring the bell. Ding, ding. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs>